G'day YouTube, welcome back to Owl's Kitchen. Uh, I've got another food review for you guys today. Now I've got the new Whiskey Whopper Burger from Hungry Jack's. I've got the meal. So, I didn't have any um, onion rings, so I've got chips again. Not a big fan of chips, especially not Hungry Jack's. They kind of like the ones you can get from the supermarket, deep fry yourself. Uh, the seasoning is not too bad, but I will say that. Large drink was a large meal, and there it is. The Whiskey Whopper Burger. All right, let's have a look. Nice big Whopper size burger. Get a look in there. Whoop, the tomato is almost falling off. It's got tomato, it's got lettuce, it's got mayonnaise. Uh, I've got some barbecue sauce in here, I think. Or whiskey bourbon sauce or something. Not bad. Sweet. Um, very barbecuey sort of flavor and angry onions mm, angry onions on there as well I can't see any bacon there might be bacon on there mm. let's have a few chips first before we tuck on into the burger not very seasoned a bit spicy Funny enough, <coughs> I don't know, it must, might have been a sauce from the burgers before. I love spicy stuff. Chips are a bit cold too. Let's let's get into the burger, I'll have a little drink of the Coke. Alright, I've had a little taste of the angry onion, the sauce. Check that out. Yeah, I think it's just a single. It's not a double. All right, let's go for a bite. Mm. Mm. A lot of flavors there. I did get the taste of the angry onion. Definitely the sauce. I'm a big fan of barbecue sauce. The sauce is really sweet. It's got a bit of a tang to it. Maybe a little bit of a spice. Not much though. Um, let's go for another bite. Of course, the flame grilled patty in Hungry Jack's Burger King in the States. Um, it's got that nice flame grilled flavor to it. Actually not bad. The flavors really come together nicely. The sauce, the angry onions, the flame grilled patty. Tomato completely loses its taste. Not complaining about that. Going for another bite, I think. Mm. You can't taste the cheese at all on there. There is cheese. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I can see melted cheese. Can't taste the cheese on there at all. I think I'll go in for one more bite and then I'll give it a score out of 10. So value-wise, it's you pretty much step paying your standard price, hundred jacks. Do you think you can make it a double and a triple? It's probably about twelve dollars, eleven dollars, maybe thirteen dollars. Uh, the large, I don't know, might have been around fifteen dollars. And then that's going to increase if you get double patty, triple patty, etc. Flavor-wise, the burger is pretty dang good. I'm pretty impressed with the burger. Um, I've had some bad run-ins with hundred jacks stale burgers and that but now nah, this this is pretty fresh um the flavors come together really nicely you got the lettuce you got the tomato which you don't really get the flavors of those but the sauce the angry onions the flame grill patty mm, absolutely fantastic but what would they give it out of 10 
Mm, value wise, it's it's your standard fare at Hungry Jack's. Flavor wise, it's pretty pretty dang good, especially the burger. Can't say much about the chips though. I'd probably give it. Oh, it's it's hard to say. Eight point two out of ten. And I mean that's mainly hanging on the burger there, because the burger tastes pretty dang good. Whip in the Hungry Jacks and get one. Try it for yourself. If you're in the States, whip in the Burger King and grab it. Try it for yourself. If you enjoyed this video, smash the like button. Uh, hit the subscribe button. Um, if you think other people might enjoy, share the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll be back with another food review. Don't know if it'll be tomorrow, but it will be pretty soon. So stay awesome, guys. Peace.